we are going to cross over to our Yi Jung Yun, uh, who joins us live from outside Im Yun Bak's home in southern Seoul. So, Jung Yun, it uh, looks like it's gotten a lot quieter over there now he's left. Hi, Mark. The former president left his home at around 9.14 a.m. in a black car with heavily tinted windows, making his relatively short trip to the Seoul Central District Prosecutor's Office. The security presence has thinned out noticeably since his departure, but it seems a handful will still remain on duty until they all return when Lee re returns home, presumably tomorrow morning. The scene might seem familiar to those who followed former President Park Geun-hye leaving her home prior to her questioning by prosecutors last year, but it's actually been a lot quieter here. Earlier, a few people came with a sign that read, A Good Day to Go to Jail, showing support for the government's initiative to rule out corruption. There was also a female protester who was pre prevented from getting too close to Lee's car as he left. The drive from Lee's residence to the prosecutor's office is around 4.7 kilometers, and it took them just eight minutes to arrive thanks to the traffic controls and police escort. And uh, Jungi, before the ex-president left, uh, a few political heavyweights brought, dropped uh, by his place uh, this morning. Did they have anything to say to the press? Yes, there was a comment from lawmaker Kim Young woo the former defense minister during the Im Young Bak administration. When asked to comment on today's situation, he said that the current Moon administration has been running to get MB to stand at the photo line, and today that dream has come true. He added that such political tragedy should not be repeated. And with that comment, he headed into the former president's house. Other well-known faces that dropped by today include Lee Dong-gwan, former presidential spokesperson, Kim Hyo-jae, former presidential secretary for political affairs, and Meng Hyang-gyu, former minister of public administration and security. That's a wrap at Lee's residence for now. Back to you, Mark. Okay, well, thank you very much for your reporting, Jung Jung-yeon.